like now Trump, he become a president. I mean, how higher you can be? I mean, the guy, they are taking him from court to court to court to court. And all of us, we knew, regardless if he is good or bad, all of this garbage is just because they don't want him to be the president. They are afraid he will go for election. We know it. And here you understand that the system is not good. Democrats are terrorists like Muhammad. They are trying to ter terrify the guy. If you don't withdraw from the election, we will put you in jail. Terrorism is just a form of terrorism. All the problems Biden he have, Hunter he have, there's no problem. January 6th is the big problem. The guy, he took a mortgage, he paid the mortgage, he did not even take extra penny. He gave them the interest, and now they are going after him. Oh, you have overvalued. They are looking for any reason to put the man down. You see, I speak against him, right? I just, five minutes ago, I told you what he is doing. But obviously what they are doing is evil. They are not decent. That's why we cannot trust the system. Like, we say that we have democracy, we have election, we don't. How we can trust the election if, if, if anyone can send a, a printed page by mail? What they will lose if everybody will vote, will go and have his ID with him? What they will lose? They will lose the election. Because then they cannot do fraud. Because we don't know who is making election. People are dead. They are voting for them. Democrat is very dangerous. You know, this last election, actually, I learned how dangerous they are. And Republicans are very naive. Until now, they think they can win the second election. Well, if they were able to do this, the, the, what they did last election, why they wouldn't do it again? Are you with me? If they can do it last last election, will they can do it now? And you know, you ask yourself, why Trump did not change from the first day he'd been elected? He have the majority in the House, have the majority in the senators. Why he did not clean the house? He did not. He was stupid. Shouldn't he change the election law when he was in charge in the Senate and in the Congress? He have full control of both. Stupid. He was busy meeting with this guy, the mentally guy, mentally ill. What's his name? The the singer. Meeting with the Kardashian? I mean, are you stupid or what? You are a president of USA and you bring Kardashian to meet with her. Who is Kardashian? Who are those people? And this is how you're saying that your president have a brain of a mosquito. He is a president already and he needs the support of Kardashian with her boobs. That is a booby trap. Isn't it, this is an insult? You are number one person as a president in the world. And then you bring those potatoes, low class people who make their money from their body, from showing, from stripping. What you will do next time you go for election, you bring Andrew Tate's? I will not be surprised by the way. I will not be surprised because they have no ethic. They will use anything, anyone. They think that he can support their election. So do you understand the problem? This is why if we want to vote, we should try to find somebody. He is conservative, a Christian, for real. Those, they have nothing to do with conservative. Those, they are just businessmen. Sex, money, 
fun and power. All those people, they go and they meet in the golf club. The business of America is done in the golf club. War and peace in golf club. Rich people. The rich, they rule. And the poor is the fool. And you believe the speeches and you get excited. I can advise him. You see, people like Trump, they cannot have advisor. Did you notice that his guy, he keep firing his official every two weeks? How many foreign minister he has? Nobody changed his foreign minister as he did. How many minister for justice? I mean, this guy, he keep firing people every two weeks. The head of his staff, the attorney, everybody. He's messed up. He is a spoiled man. He grew up as a rich person, rich boy. Women, parties, drinking, TV show, you know. Uh, and now he became the president. He thinks it's the same thing. He still deal with himself as a president, the same as he was a boy for show. Can Trump win once again? I think he can win if there's election. But if the claim that they won the election by false vote, then how we can trust that there is an election and why he is going for election if they can do it first time when he is the president? Listen to me carefully. If Biden was able to corrupt the election when Trump was in charge, Biden will not be able to do it when he is in charge? And here you ask yourself, why even Trump is going for election then? Isn't it weird? If you know they are cheaters and they will cheat, why you are you going? What's the point of this election? Or what they need to do? To do what the same they did last time. Who do you like in politics? I like nobody. It's not about a person, it's about what they do. <clears throat> anyway who should be the next president I think uh, the sentence the you know uh, he is a smart he's educated uh, his wife is very smart too he have a good advisor I, I heard her making a speech uh, and you know he did a lot of work not like Trump this guy he, he you know he drove those nuts the woke culture like crazy this is the guy they fear. Trump is nobody. Trump, Trump, if he take the election again, he win. All what he said before the election will not happen. Lock her down, lock her down. Second day, he's shaking hand with Hillary Clinton. He's a talker. After he become president, he will do nothing, if he become. The census is the man they fear. This guy, he gave his crew Disneyland. Disneyland is like an empire in Florida. They have their own land. They have their own police. They have their own governor. They, they, they are independent. They are totally independent. I don't think the sentence will lose to Biden because he is the man, my friend. And even if he loses, better than having a, a loser as a president. Trump will be a loser again. He will spend his time making a speech about how good he is, how smart he is. The only thing he will do good, he will start drilling oil and the guy's price will go down and prices of food and everything will go down. Okay, that's wonderful. But that thing can be done anyway, by anyone. If a Trump he won, he will spend the first five weeks talking about how good he is and how smart he is. 
and how stupid everyone else. And then he will hire people who praise him, which means he will hire people who they are hypocrite. Because the second you criticize him, he will fire you. So the fool will stay a fool. He will not accept anyone he work with him, criticize him. So he will not learn from his mistake and he will not correct his mistakes. However, if you ask me, for sure I prefer Trump over anyone from the other party. Like imagine now this guy Biden, he die. I mean, that would be horrible. We will have this uh, laughing machine, Harris. Ha ha ha. What do you think about Vivek? I mean, this guy should not even be in the stage. He's just a kid. Go right now, check where he is. I'm sure he's in the bar. Presidency should not be for someone too old. He cannot remember his name. And should not be for someone is too young for it's easy for him to be doomed. Should be for someone is a smart, intelligent, educated, have experience. Not just a guy, he just took off his jeans and he is 30 years old and now he want to become a president. Kid, he's a kid. His friend will call him, hey, should we bring the girls? Have a party? Imagine Hunter Biden become the president now. And by the way, Hunter is way older than this guy. So don't do it. It's a kid. It is just a kid. You have always to have somebody have experience. And you know, age is very important because, you know, when you are just a, a very young, uh, life will take you, you know, uh, many temptation. You, you have different interests. Your energy in different place. You need an older man, stable. He have, a, you know, he have a wife. He's married. Uh, he is decent. He have a good reputation. And at the same time, he prove himself in things he do, like the sentence. Trump is an idiot. Biden is an idiot. The only one was smart, by the way, between them, it was Obama. Obama is a snake. When Obama took the office, the first thing he did, he fired all the high officers who they are Christian conservative in the army. And he replaced them with the woke officers. See what they do? He start, he's like Erdogan learning from his cousin Erdogan. Erdogan, he took all the judges who they are liberals. In the case of Obama, he did the opposite because what make him survive is the liberals. So he took all the conservatives from the army as high ranks. What did Trump he did? Nothing. This is why when this happened, none of the officers in the army support him. I'm talking about the high rank officers. He's stupid. He was busy doing stupid things, meeting with the Kardashian and the other singer and the other guy who is supposedly like they consider him racist, inviting you know people to the White House to do stupid stuff, going to Saudi Arabia for things we do not need. And he is proud about a check from Saudi Arabia. He is proud about peace agreement with Israel and the country inside is the worm is eating his White House. Before you go to check what's happening outside, you better clean your house first. All right? Before you go abroad to help Israel, he spent a lot of time about Israel, but he did not notice what's going on behind him. And then when the election came, surprise, surprise, the idiot, he found that he was an idiot. <laughs>